having been in the system and survived and thrived in spite of it, what can change within the system that can actually bring about more positive outcomes? What could help uh, incarcerated folks is to actually allow them to be treated and considered as human beings to start with. So three quick points. First, we have to elect people with uh, intestinal fortitude to do the right things, right? Like, we have to elect... We have to elect good folks. You need elected officials to say, I'm gonna do the tough work, and then we need to be there when they are undoubtedly gonna face backlash. backlash yeah. We have to be there and try to recall you. It failed miserably, right? Because the people, on, like, on the ground said, hey, you know what? We're gonna back these politicians up, point one. Point two. The work that we do is about safety. Mm -hmm. It's not just the absence of crime, it's the presence of well-being. Right. When you think about safety, just think about it for a minute. Where you felt most safe? What did it smell like? What did it taste like? Aesthetically, what did it look like? Right? No one answering those questions ever said, police sirens, jail, prison, probation, parole. <laughs> no, you're like, backyard barbecues with my Lana. You know what I mean? But we don't have a system that's rooted in shared safety. We have a crime response system. So if we truly want to stop the guy from defecating on the side of the street, don't put handcuffs. Put your arm around him and say, what do you need? A continuum of care. Last point. Wow. Wow. Last point. Last point. There are 100 million people in this country that have a criminal record. There's 100 million of us here. We served our time. We paid our debt to society, and we're facing 40 thousand legal restrictions. When will my sentence end? If my time is done, my sentence should be complete. Whether it's two years, three years, four years, five years, heck, give me 10 years. At least shield the record so I can go on with my life. We have to stop people from not being able to take care of themselves and their family. And that's repairing the harm, that's passing sunset laws in every single state.